Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. It is Super Cali here, bringing you guys The Witcher 3 Wild Hunt. So currently, I am binge recording. Because today, as this is going out, I am officially go, go. leaving on my trip to Europe. So this and the next five episodes after this are all going to be of me binging and recording. So this all happened all on the same day. Just so you all know. Hey there. So let's get this started. Not now. What'd I just do? Ha! <laughs> I just broke it already. Oh, I am so smart. Watching for Nilfgaard's fleet. Fleet? Oh, hey, they mentioned something. Nay, I've more important matters on my mind. By my calculations, today is the day Gavor, the legendary white whale, will swim the waters of Skellige. Been waiting for this my whole life. I'll watch. Let's with watch you. for Gavor together, and you can tell me what you know about any elven ruins in Skellige. My hair, though. Jesus. It's like I can't control it. Heard of some cavern no one's been able to enter? Good thing to <sighs> Else lies it have wandered it long ago like all the others. Oh. Avon. What? I uh, just wanted to assure you I only want to look around the cavern. It's research. He <laughs> missed the whale. Writing an adventure novel. Gathering material for it. Mean to write up the coming of the White Fleet? Try, my dear. Mayhaps you could use my translation of the Song of Gilban and Dillion. Gladly, gladly. So where's this cavern? Got a sail east from Kertrolda. Caverns in a cove, only accessible from the sea. So long, and good luck with the White Whale. It'll show today. I'm sure of it. Yeah, I kind of already did, um, but you missed it. <laughs> okay. Oh my god, my nose is like a little runny right now, so I apologize for sniffling. Because I just, it's like very early today, and I'm recording very early, and I went out very early to like walk to freaking Dunkin' Donuts to get a donut and to do my exercises so I can record, and I'm just like, oh. yes. Okay, so I probably want to fast travel. Yeah, I thought so. Kertruga. I'm gonna sneeze soon, I can feel it. I apologize in advance for the sneezing I am about to do. Who are there, Witcher? You looking for work by any chance? Nope, not looking for contracts. Don't do contracts. Sometimes I feel like I'm not getting it enough out of the YouTube series by not doing any contracts, but like... It would be too... this series is already so long. Going somewhere? Siri says there's a site in Skellige we must examine. Avalok's clearly hiding something from us. Hmm. Earlier, when we were in the Isles together, Avalach mentioned a laboratory. At one point, he wished to teleport there, to retrieve something, and he refused to take me with him. It was all very strange. Sufficiently suspicious, don't you think? Yeah. So what? Want to just sneak in and root around? Exactly. Coming with? Fine. Where is it? On a small isle between Undvik and Spikarog. Not exactly on our way. Just found out the sunstones on Ard Skellig. Cavern along the coast that we can only access from the Where's sea. Where's she going? Gonna need some real magic to get in, too. Go find this laboratory. I'll explore Ard Skellig. You can join me later. Philippa, your eyesight. Only just recovered and magically simulated. Didn't you say you'd need some time to get accustomed? Did I? She could be. 
Commissary. We'll await you there. Am I gonna question Avalok before I go? Where'd he go? Ramen supper I never refuse. Okay, maybe I'm not. So now what am I doing? Um Okay, we're gonna keep doing the Sunstone one because that's the one we were doing all last episode. So it just makes sense to keep doing this, to keep doing that one. I just need to find a fast travel point. And I'll be good. Oh. Wait, how am I going to get over there? Well, that's fun. Okay. So, I gotta find a way over there. This seems like something I would, like, sail towards. Is that possible? Could I take that boat over there and sail around? Seems like that would be a lot easier if I could do that. Yeah, there's a cavern right there. I should just take the boat. What am I doing? I've been really dumb of me to not do that. So we're gonna go. I'm more worried about Philippa being by herself with her bad eyesight than I would be with um, Yennefer and Siri going off on their own first. So since we spent the whole last episode doing the stuff with the Sunstone, might as well just keep doing that. Let's go meet up with Philippa first and make sure she doesn't get herself killed or something. And then we can go meet up with the other girls. Must be the one we got. Can I there we go? Oh. Here we go. This is a lot easier than taking a roach going all the way through everything. Where let's face it, I would probably run into some monsters or some Something that's gonna try to kill me. This would probably be way easier, considering it's on a cavern in the water. It's also closer. Hopefully there won't be any sirens around the edge here waiting for me, because that would not be fun. <laughs> Why do I talk? Why do I do these things to myself? Maybe I can just avoid them? Yeah? Okay. <sighs> I need to stop doing that. Oh no, there's more. Well, so far, so good. Remember when I was going to find Siri, and I had to go through all those sirens? I had to, like, I had to cut that video up real good to make it so it wasn't 40 minutes long. Okay, we're, we're here. Oh, thank god, there's a fast, a fast, uh, fast travel. Leave the helm. Thank you. Just wonderful. What do you say? Look at this. Hmm. Isn't Let's that go. Nice? What now? Gonna grow yourself some new eyes, like Vilgefortz did. I remember the moment I killed him. 
The cultivation wasn't complete. They hadn't grown in fully yet. Looked disgusting, but... I take it your mention of that deviant is purely coincidental. Of course. Also heard of this rich blind dwarf from Mahakam. Had them put two sizable rubies in his eye sockets. Couldn't yeah. see that damn thing. Hmm. But word is, it looked pretty tasteful. Okay, why do they keep... I know how to do the thing, stop. I just want Axie. Why is there still magic in your hand? Hmm. So how do we get up the... The stairs? I'll fix them right away. Oh, I just realized that she's glowing in the eyes. I just fell. It's very hard on Syria. There are times I doubt you three realize how it looks. Triss plays the big sister to Siri, but eagerly awaits a chance to hop in bed with you. You and Yennefer play the parents. Yeah, so if you're angling to make it a five sum, there's clearly no room. <laughs> So far, I have not failed. I'm just following Philippa's lead at this point. What now? It appears I must do everything for you. See the sentry who seems to be waiting for payment. I'm fresh out of change. Oh, in blood, not coin. The sentry is Fiona of the Elven legend. Do you literally read nothing? Sorry, I'm not. Oh. Okay, looks empty. Yennefer must have tremendous pull with the Emperor to get him to guarantee the Lodge's safety. What's your take on it? My take? Obviously a leading question. No. Geralt, I'm tired. Let's sit and chat a bit first. Is foreplay that important to you? <laughs> this deal with Amir. It's sorcerous business. Pick someone else's brain. So she's not told you anything? What about personal plans? Has she mentioned anything? A possible advisory position? 
beside a young, promising empress? Stay away from Ciri. She's an adult, Geralt. You keep forgetting. She can decide for herself. So, onward. Alrighty then. Don't you think it's time you stopped interfering in Ciri's life? No. But you do know we're not a pack of wolves you can just drive away from her with your sword. Sure you are. And yes, I can, if the need arises. Well, what am I going to have to kill next? I know something else is in here. Wait. There's something here. Feel it? No. My medallion. A ridiculous bauble. Don't make me laugh. Tuning into elven magic is just slightly more difficult than sniffing out a malodorous fiend. Watch this. Arahan Numa! Sunstone is here. Don't stand there looking stupid. Try to shift the mirrors. Um, sounds like a puzzle. I was like, what the team, what you just do? with puzzles. I feel like that one over there needs to change. Okay, can I get up there then? How do I? Oh. I see it. The path is literally telling me which way I have to go to get up there. As if that is the first place I have to go. <laughs> Leave it to me to not. Oh, okay, you're fine. You're, you're, you're fine and everything, but let's not. Two freaking lovers. Okay, so maybe these two don't need to actually be moved. Maybe it's this one up here. I'm running out of like, I, I'm, I'm running out of thoughts. Cause everything I do seems to not work. Just do everything and see if that happens. See if it what happens, because I don't know. I got nothing else. I'm not good with puzzles. Puzzles are not my thing. This is not why I play this game. This is not Uncharted. I get enough of that with Uncharted. So I'm not sure how to set up this mirror system properly because they're already like all reflecting off each other. So what am I doing? Maybe I do just have to re just switch all of them. I mean, they only go two ways, so. 
Let's get out of here. Not so fast. We have a matter to discuss. Let me guess. You gotta fly. You're about to tell me why you need the Sunstone so much more than we do. Then you'll change into an owl and whoosh. No idea where you got such a ridiculous notion. <laughs> Ciri's safety is most important to me now. But I wish to talk to you about the future. My future. I recommend the Alpine Air of Nazir. You'll like Nilfgaard, no two ways about it. I recommend the fresh Alpine Air of Nazir. <laughs> and Yennefer claims you have no sense of humor. Now listen carefully. Once we've defeated the hunt and Ciri is safe, Yennefer's meteoric rise at the Imperial Court will come to an abrupt end. Which is wonderful from my perspective. I'm not interested in reviving the Lodge if I'm not to have the deciding vote. You're telling me this because... If I know even one bit, I expect that once we've defeated the Wild Hunt, you aim to slip out the back door with Ciri. To disappear into the wilds, correct? All very romantic. But perhaps instead of destroying the girl's life, you could take Yennefer with you and go. Done? Can I go? Any other words of wisdom? Or can we go? You may go. I know you have things to do. I can find my own way back. There she goes again, turning into an owl and flipping away. Flip, flip, flying away. Am I... Is this the way out? Is that why they showed me this? What now, you piece of filth? No, no, no. There we go. Two ghosts. Dead. Okay. I think this is the way out. I don't know why they would have showed me this passage if it wasn't the way out. So let's just go this way and see what happens. We got the, um, oh Jesus. We got the sunstone, so that's awesome. I'm overweight. I gotta drop one of these stupid swords that I took. Or I can just drop this. There, now I'm not overweight. Um, how do I get out of here? 
So I don't think I went the wrong way. Is it that end? No. I'm just going higher and higher. More ghosts. Take anything else. Oh, hey, look, the way out. <laughs> that works. Works for me. Oh, there's a monster den right there. That's whatever. Um. So, where do we come out? Oh. Very far away. Okay. Well, guys, that is going to be it for this episode of. The Witcher 3 Wild Hunt. I am binge recording, so I'm going to keep continuing, and I will see you guys in the next episode. I love you all. Be kind to one another. Bye, guys. Bye.